hello guys you welcome to my youtube channel and in today's video i'm going to show you how you can easily create a wise account that you can use to send and receive money internationally so for example you are into freelancing you could set up a wise account that you can use to receive money from your clients and from your customer and for example if you are into drop shipping you could also set up a wise account that you can use to receive payment or link directly with your stripe account that you can use to receive payment from your drop shipping business so if this something you like to do i want you to stick around watch this video to the end so the first thing we're going to do now is to um, go to the edition of the video i'm going to add a link to some wise at the edition of the video so just go there click the link and once you click on the link you're going to see something like this so once you're on the home page of wise what you want to do is come over here then click on register or if you want to use the platform to send money immediately you could also come over here indicate how much you want to send so say for example you want to send 100 um, us dollar and you want to send the money to a british pounds account just select um, gdp here and you're going to see the amount of money the person is going to receive in the gdp currency so if you're okay the next thing you want to do now is to come over here then click on send money now so i'm not sending any money now so what i'm going to do is i'm just going to come over here then i'm going to click on register so what you want to do here now is come over here then enter your email address so here i'm going to paste my email address and the next thing i'm going to do is to come over here then click on next so i'm going to click on next so after that it's going to prompt you to choose whether you're going to be creating a personal account or a business account so if you are going for a personal account now this account is going to be in your name and the us bank account or other currency account you're going to be having is going to be in your name but if you are going for a business account that means you need to have a business incorporated in the us that means you need to have an llc and this llc details is what you're going to be using to create your business account on why so that means you need to have an ein you need to have a business name a business address in the us and a us phone number so if you have that in place you could also come over here then click on business account and the best part is you could actually create a personal account first and when you want to create a business account as well you could upgrade your account to business account so you can have a personal account inside your wise account and also have a business account inside your wise account so for the sake of this video we're going to be going with personal account so what you want to do is come over here then select personal account so here is going to prompt you to choose a country where you live so what you want to do is you want to come over here then click on this drop down menu then select your country so once you select your country you want to search um, the state here then choose your state and click continue so we can proceed then after that I'm um, come over here then click continue so the next thing you're going to be doing now is to come over here then enter your phone number so they can verify your account with your phone number so what you want to do is um, enter your phone number based on the country you choose okay so depending on the country you choose your phone number is going to be entered based on that country code so what i'm going to do now is quickly enter my phone number here so they can send a verification code to the number and so i can use the code to verify my account okay so i've just entered my phone number so the next thing i'm going to do now is to come over here then click on send verification code all right so the verification code has been sent to my phone number so the next thing i'm going to do now is to come over here enter the verification code and submit so we can proceed so i've just entered the verification code so the next thing i'm going to do now is to click on submit here all right so i've just entered my phone number so the next thing i'm going to do now is to create a password for my account so once you enter your password the next thing you want to do is come over here then click on continue so once your account is created now the next thing you want to do now is to enter some of your details here so as you can see um the first one is your country so after that you're going to enter your first legal name and your middle name so your full legal last name is going to come over here then your date of birth so your date of birth is going to come here your month and your year is going to come here so after that your so after that which so after that is going to be your number so the number has been entered already so once you've entered all of the details the next thing you have to do now is to come over here then click on continue so let me quickly enter mine so we can continue and proceed to the next step so the next step here is for you to enter your address so as you can see it says you need to provide a proof of this letter 
so this means you're going to be needing to verify your address in the future so make sure you enter an address that is correct so what i'm going to do is come over here then enter my address so we can proceed so after that come over here then click on continue so the next step here is for you to choose your nationality which is going to be the country at which you are giving birth to so what you want to do is um click on this drop down menu here then search for your country select your country enter it here and proceed so as you can see we've successfully created our wise account so it says what would you like to do first would you like to send money or would you like to receive money so if you click on receive money this means you'll be able to get your own um, personal usd bank account that is going to come in your own name so this bank account is what you're going to be sending to people and this is where they can actually pay you to and receive the money into your wise account so if you click on send money it's going to walk you through the process of you sending money then um, verifying your account that is uploading your national id card and stuff like that so let me click on spend or receive money so next come over here then click on continue so here is prompting you to choose the currency at which you want to get paid so if it's going to be in us dollar you can just select us dollar if it's going to be in indian rupee you can choose indian rupee here and if it's going to be in canadian dollar you can choose canadian dollar here so i'm going to leave it at us dollar then after that i'm going to come over here then click on continue so as a bonus you could also get a wise card that you can use to make payments online so if you want that all you simply need to do is click on get a wise card but if you don't want that click on maybe later so for the sake of the video i'm just going to come over here then click on maybe later so the next thing you want to do now is to agree to the terms of use so what you want to do is just scroll to the bottom of the page then after that click on i agree so guys we've successfully created our wise account so the next step now is for us to go through a verification process and mind you i already have a wise account so this is just a tutorial based account to show you how you yourself can create your own wise account so i'm not going to go through the verification process but i just want to show you how you yourself can successfully create your wise account so when you get to the um, verification process here it's going to prompt you to enter an amount you want to deposit in your bank account which is going to be inside your wise account so once you deposit money inside your wise account they will be able to generate a usd bank account number that is going to be in your own name so depending on the currency you choose now the bank account for that currency is going to carry the name on your personal account so here what you want to do is select the amount you want to deposit so if it's going to be 20 us dollar just leave it at 20 us dollar then after that click on continue so when you click on continue now before you click on continue it's going to prompt you to choose a payment method that is that is the method at which you're going to be and uh, that is the method you're going to be using to deposit the money into your wise account so here i'm going to click on plus here yeah? so when you click on plus you're going to see the option available so we have um connected bank account which is ach we have wire transfer debit card or credit card so what you want to do is depending on how you want to deposit the money if it's going to be debit or credit just select any of the two but most of the time it should be a debit card so um you can just come over and change it to debit card so after that you're going to see how much um they are going to deduct from the card so the total amount is going to be 20.48 us dollar so after that click on continue and when you click on continue it's going to prompt you to enter the details of the debit card you want to use to deposit the money so once you've entered the details of the card the next thing is going to prompt you to do is to verify your account by uploading your national id so when you upload this your account is going to be verified and once your account is verified you're going to be able to have your currency bank account number in your wife's account and once you've done this your wife's account has been successfully created so if you still want to create a business uh wife's account you could also do that all you simply need to do is just make sure you have a registered business in the us an ein a us phone number and a us address once you have all of this you'll be able to create a business account inside your wise account so once you've done all of that you can now successfully use um, your wise account to receive money and send money internationally so this is basically how you can create your wise account successfully so if you like the video please give it a thumbs up and if you are yet to subscribe to the youtube channel please subscribe so you can get more videos like this all right thanks for watching i'll see you in the next one